Yo, it's blue and you tune in to Ball Alert. First of all, you look fly as hell. Thank you. What are you wearing? Uh, it's some custom Fendi, you know what I'm saying, that I got, you know, from my uh, my stylist. Shout out Rich God, you know what I'm saying. You said that's so sly, like that's just normal custom Fendi, you know, the huge, the huge. I love it, I love it. What are you looking forward to most being at the BET Awards 2022? We outside. Uh, really just seeing the show. I ain't never been, so, you know, I'm just locked in, just trying to see everybody, you know what I'm saying, just see all the performances and stuff like that, so. I'm simple. I'm a simple guy. You always say that. It's so funny, because you really do. <laughs> I'm a simple guy. I don't know why I be asking me questions. I'm going to say the most simple thing. <laughs> lastly, <laughs> lastly, you are. But two of the biggest names in music just dropped House Projects, Beyonce and Drake. Mm -hmm. It originated in the 80s by black people in Chicago. What does this mean for our culture? And can you see other people hopping on this trend? Uh, yeah, I mean, I feel like, you know, uh, like me myself, like I already been doing like a lot of, you know, different type of versions of every type of music, you know what I'm saying? So uh, before he even dropped that, like I was already working on some like, you know, I was working on some stuff like kind of that, uh, you know, but Drake a trendsetter though, so he always going, you know, going to drop, drop. But I feel like it's going to be big regardless. I mean, all type of music, black people invented a lot of different type of music. So, you know. We ain't doing nothing but just rewinding and tapping into old roots, you know what I'm saying? So it's, it's natural for everybody. I love that. Yep. Thank you so much.